find each other's group of five men, only five, downtown straight to a rival gang. Not supposed to hurt the other gangs. No rule against tricking them into hurting each other, though. I thought about trying my hand at the gauntlet just to see if I could do it. Waste of time now. No one's topping your performance. Visitors, you get special treatment. So, the box is a vault dweller. Or ice the vault dweller.
over, boss. Making trouble? Good. Hmm. Our new boss. You're going to want to talk to Mags. Hey. Well, I suppose we all owe you for putting down Coulter. Man was an idiot. Made us all look bad. <laughs> A clown stuck in his own little car. I guess we can take some solace in the fact that someone finally gave him what he deserved. I want to know, what did you feel as you did it? when you brought that walking pile of human garbage to his knees. Taking down an opponent like that? It's thrilling. Sure looked it. Hmm. Perhaps you're better suited to this than I expected. Regardless, Gage's decree means that you're the new overboss. I suppose we can only hope you work out better than the last one. I'm Mags. This is my brother, William. Pleasure. Along with our co-conspirator, Lizzie, we run this crew. Call ourselves the Operators. You'll come to understand soon enough that we are the only gang you should be backing around here. Because we're the only ones who see this place for what it is. A temple. A testament to the only thing that matters in this world. Um... Soda? <laughs> Not quite. Caps. This place was built for the sole purpose of taking caps out of the pockets of fools. We only joined Gage and Coulter's little menagerie in order to restore it to that goal. Though by somewhat more cutthroat methods than I expect its founders intended. Instead, Coulter had us sitting on our asses for the better part of a year while he lived large in his damn mountain top. And that means, if you're going to be in charge around here, We'd like some assurances that you intend to bring this place back to its true purpose. And that we're going to get back to robbing folks of their fucking money. Actually, I'm really more in this for the soda. Great. Another nut- William. Of course, overboss. So, you're welcome in the parlor whenever you like. Make yourself at home. And if you think you might be interested in running some jobs for us, you just come speak to me. But do take a little time to consider the kind of life we could all have if we put this place back to doing what it does best. Mags always saw the potential in this place, and she doesn't steer us wrong. That's it. 
Mother, it's Matt. Thank you so much for your date. It kept William, Lizzie, and I very entertained during our time in the holding cell. We found the part about refusing us our inheritance particularly amusing. Because that money is ours. Years we spent under your thumb, trying to be the perfect little dolls you always wanted. We both have the scars to prove it. So if you think we didn't burn every cap that's due to us, then you're even dumber than I thought. We're coming for those caps. And there's nothing you can do to stop us. Got it. I never grasped the allure of the other gangs. Nothing but t targets with fur and trash piles with attitude. Diagnostic complete. I'm happy to report I won't be falling apart on you anytime soon. If Lizzie asks you to volunteer for one of the tests, don't. of Gage's little plan to replace Colton it wasn't just to make sure the bosses didn't take his head off too. So this will be test eight of the persuasion formula. Lizzie. Okay, we're just gonna call you. When Coop finds out about this, they're gonna wear your skin. They ever let you Go to hell. As you can see, Eight is currently not receptive to my suggestions. Now, deploying the formula. Uh, what? What the? Hey! Hey, yourself. Eight, how do you feel right now? Now, eight, I'm going to untie your arm. Okay. Never did get white culture brought in three games. Now, eight, I want you to hit yourself. Hit myself? Please. Ah! Again, please. Harder this time.
That's perfect. Thank you, Eight. You can stop now. Thank you. You're welcome. Eight, I'm going to untie you. Now, if you wouldn't mind... Eight! <laughs> what are you... <clears throat> are you an idiot? Did you really think that shit would work? I'm gonna eat him. I'm... I'm going to need a minute before you bring in number nine. something boss I want to know more about Nuka world yeah good call big time amusement park back before the world went to shit well I guess if this place is any indication it wasn't so hot before it all blew up anyway we weren't the first to think of this place as a good stronghold before we got here a bunch of traders had set up shop and hired a whole lot of guns to protect them they were dug in like ticks. That's why it took pulling a bunch of gangs together to even have a chance. You've got this area of the park. Isn't that enough? Why do you want more? You got a lot to learn, boss. So we've got Nuka Town. And most of the traders work for us now. They ain't happy about it, but screw them. We really need the rest of these parks, though. Every one of them not under our control is a threat. And the gangs are too cramped up. They're stepping all over each other. Unless they get room to spread out, there's gonna be bloodshed. So the sooner you get them all to agree to follow orders, the sooner we can improve our situation. You, uh, got any more questions? Aren't you raiders all the same? Hey, come on now. No need to be insulting. Commonwealth gangs, well, most of them don't even qualify. They ain't organized. They don't make smart decisions. Basically one step up from rabid animals. I've run with some of them over the years. Every single time, they either think way too small or get themselves wiped out. I make a point of getting the hell out of Dodge before that happens. I don't get it, Gage. What's the appeal of all this? Oh, come on. It ain't that hard to see. You take whatever you want from whoever you want. Anybody has a problem with that, you cut them down. You telling me that doesn't sound like even just a little bit of fun to you? Anyway, don't mistake the gangs out here for being the same as those Commonwealth saps. Gangs out here, they got agendas. And they're gonna expect results. You can't afford to forget that. You need anything else? Tell me more about the gangs. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Quite the assorted bunch. All used to hate each other, and I guess maybe they still do to a degree. Took a shitload of work to get them all on board with this idea, so... I really don't want to lose them now. If I were you, I'd start with the Disciples. They might all be crazy, probably are in fact, but Nisha has her reasonable moments. Then you've got the Operators. Spoiled, rich kids. But doesn't mean they ain't ruthless killers. If you can impress Mags, She'll listen to you. And then there's the pack. I'm not saying they're savages, but, well, shit, they're savages. I don't know how Mason keeps them on a leash. Up to you who you want to trust the most, but you're gonna need to trust at least some of them. You need anything else? Nothing else for now. All right. You know where to find me.
Things are boring as hell since Nisha made us team up. I ain't no fan of playing nice with others. A rival gang that didn't two shits about it. Now, like I said, Atlas, he refused to get in his way. Sure, we carry guns, but knives are exact. It's not fun unless you're a person. Watch yourself, boss. Because we sure will be. Come across any hobologist crazies? Just ignore them. Tell those freaks to stick to their camp. Hey. Yeah. Hey. Gage must have pulled a few strings if someone like you is in charge now. Dragon. We're giving him a second chance. Gage screws this up. He knows we'll skin him alive. So shut up and be patient. What about you, big guy? Nothing to say on the matter? As long as he doesn't get in my way, don't much care. Yeah, figured as much. Both of you just get out of here. And make sure the others get the message. The new OB, huh? I reckon you're here to talk to Nisha. She's in charge. <laughs> don't look like much to me. You want to talk? Talk the mission. Hey there. So, you're Gage's little pet project. <laughs> and what are you? His grandma? <laughs> if I was, I would have slit that little suck-up's throat a long time ago. Gage will never be one of us. He's a failure. He's lucky we're giving him a second chance. Everyone knows we all wanted Coulter dead. Of course, if I had my way. It would have been a slow, painful process. But whatever. Let's get this meet and greet over with. I'm Nisha. I lead the Disciples. We've only got one rule around here, and that's keeping the peace of this... Alliance. Otherwise, the way we see it, this world stopped caring about rules the moment people started dropping bombs on one another. I bet you guys are great at parties. Side with us, you'll soon find out. Just don't slack off when it comes to actually doing your job. We got Coulter Nuka Town, and suddenly he forgot the big picture. We both know how that turned out. Although I could give him a little credit. 
He built the gauntlet, after all. Of course, it was total shit at first. No imagination. But we spiced it up a bit. I thought it was pretty impressive. Good to see the new boss at least has some taste. I might let you keep that head on your shoulders after all. Let's just hope Gage is right about you. He made a lot of promises to get us here. And never followed through. So you better not screw this up, because I'm not about to tolerate another round of bullshit. I'm the best there is. Willing to bet your life on that? You see, the Disciples don't make empty threats. We make good on them. We aren't swayed by caps like those spoiled brats obsessed with their hair, or those savage animals who can't behave in public. Fuck this up, and I will kill you. Although, I admit I have even better plans for Gage. But, if you support us and keep your promises like a good little overboss, we back you. You get to live, and everybody wins. Work for me? I'll get you whatever you want. Good. You're either smart, or you value your life. Either way, that's exactly what I wanted to hear. Now, if you're really looking to get on my good side, there's no shortage of work around here. So, if you're looking to prove you've got what it takes, you know where to find me. That last one died too fast. Killing beats stealing any day. Nothing beats that rush. Nisha really only has one rule around here. Don't get caught. Hope we get more gauntlet runners soon. Need some excitement around here. You may run Nuka World, but this is Disciple territory. We're in charge. If I hear them pack animals talking trash one more time, they're gonna wake up short a few body parts. Those hey, pack Dixie. Holes even I love it wrong. when the traders try to They're escape dead. from the collar triggers. Nothing like watching a head game. Living this area seems pretty scarce. I'm thinking of packing it in and heading back to the common. Hey, Ruth. Sammy just came back with this girl, Dixie, and brought the back. I had it out with that disciple chick again today, Anna. I'm tired of her always. Winning. She's got better aim, better comebacks, even packed a better punch. Well, not for long. Fuck these rules. I'm going after her. Then, when she's floating face down in the swamp pond, we'll see who's better. I can't wait to see. What the hell? How'd you get in here? What? A girl's got her ways. I'm just here because Anna's big into helping Nisha keep the peace between all us gangs. Me? I'm not so much. What the? That should keep you quiet till I get you back to Fizz Top. Oh, were you recording this just for little old me? You operators are such sweethearts. If the pack is going to howl all the time, we could at least be good at it.
I can't believe we didn't deal with Coulter ourselves. General. I can't believe we're in a real castle. I bet nothing can get us in here. Hey.
Let's see what kind of armor you've got. Excuse me. I'm sure I've got something you need. If you need a weapon, you come to the right place. I've got a few minutes to browse. Here's what I've got.
What have you got to trade today? Thank you. It's like I can finally think straight. What's good today? Look at you. Two centuries, and your skin's as smooth as ever.
gotta chase what you want to catch. Careful out there. The park's a pretty dangerous place. Sierra. Here's hoping they didn't hide the cappies too well. Not supposed to hurt the other gangs. No rule against tricking them into hurting each other. That last one died too fast. Gotta be something good in here. We'd all considered putting a bullet in Coulter's back at some point. Suppose you just beat us to it. Things are boring as hell since Nisha made us team up. I ain't no fan of playing nights with others. Spare parts, you'll be sure to let me know. <laughs> 